Baby, be in love with your fantasies. I can be a star, make a sky so bright. Welcome to my dungeon. This is ecstasy. Let me play the fantasy. What's good, YouTube? It's your girl Asia. And it's your boy BJ. And, and we, we back, back like we never <laughs> left. I want to ask everybody a question out here. Everybody that got kids, that have raised kids, how did you teach them how to tell time? Or did you let somebody else teach them how to tell time? I feel like I had a hard time with time. <laughs> when I learned it in school. You had a hard time learning? I freaking hated it. I'm like, if we're not going by the 15 minute increments or the, thir or the 30 minute increments, you you can't ask me how many minutes if I add like 50 minutes. I, I can't tell you what time it's going to be in 50 minutes. Yeah. Back then. See. <laughs> See, I can tell you see, now. see, even then back then we knew that you was like that you was vertically challenged, that you had a <laughs> that you had an incline to climb. You had a ways to climb. I couldn't wait to get past that subject in school. I remember that like the back of my head. I hated it. Yeah. But blessed be thy name, you made it out on the other end. Yeah, now you you, I, did, for, you did pretty good for yourself. Take you backwards and forward if you need me to. Right. But I'm just saying. And y'all, she still don't know how to tell time. Anyways. Uh, we about to be watching. I know you're not talking. You be the me, main one. Let me go ahead. Let me go ahead. I got this. I got oh, this. I got okay. you. I got okay. you. I got you in a minute. Okay. Uh, we about to be checking out Dave Allen, and <laughs> this is about teaching your kids time. <laughs> I feel All like right. he about to talk about me in this video. You think so? <laughs> everything I freaking like hated back then. Like he about to probably say everything like all. I of think you're good. I think you're good. Okay. We're about to see. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Smash the notification bell so you don't miss any videos. Let's go ahead and jump into this. All right. Teaching your kid time. So one of the most important things we as parents do is we teach our children about time. We teach them important things like reading the clock. You actually think that's important? I'm going to teach you to read the clock. Teach you to read the time. Why? Why? Because it's important that you know the time. Why? <laughs> because how would you know when to get up to go to school? M mummy would make me. <laughs> what if mummy wasn't there? You, you'd wake me. What if we both weren't there? Wouldn't go to school. <laughs> <laughs> how would you know when breakfast was? I'd be hungry. Shut up! <laughs> Somebody came along to you and said, what time is it? And you didn't know, you'd feel stupid. <laughs> well, why doesn't he feel stupid? He doesn't know. <laughs> Let me go through this whole thing. I'm going to teach you. I did it myself, with my son. I'm going to teach you how to read the clock. Now, this is a clock. It's not actually a clock. It is a clock, but it's not a clock. It's a watch. It's called a watch. It's a wristwatch because it's on my wrist. <laughs> yes, it's a wristwatch because it's on my wrist and I watch it. Yes, it's very good. <laughs> now... <laughs> And There's I'll watch. Time is made up of zones, periods of time, all right? There's, there's hours and minute. No, not hours. No, they're not hours. <laughs> they're hours. <laughs> they don't belong to us. It's a different spelling. H-O-U-R-S. Not Howards. <laughs> it's silent. I don't know. <laughs> Now, on every day, there are 24 hours, 24 of these hours, 12 in the day and 12 in the night. I know I said there are 24 hours in a day, 12 in the day, 12 in the night. But a day is made up of a day and a night. Oh, my God. What are you, stupid? <laughs> I couldn't very well say Monday, Monday night. Everybody knows when I say Monday, I'm talking about the 24 hours. Now shut up and listen. <laughs> now, on every clock or watch, there are three pointers. They're called hands, all right? They point to the hour, all right? You understand that? There's the hour hand. That's the first hand, the hour hand. The second hand is the minute hand, and the third hand is the second hand. <laughs> Shut up! 
We'll do away. Forget about the third hand. Forget it. It's gone, all right? It's gone. Now we have two hands. On the face of the clock, there are two hands, all right? There's the hour hand, which is the fat hand, and there's the thin hand, which is the minute hand. So you have a fat hand and a thin hand, all right? Fat hand, hours, thin hand, minutes. Right. Now, up the top of the clock, you see the number up there, one and two. One and two is 12. It's not three. <laughs> it would be three if you joined them together. We already have a three here on the side by itself. We don't need two bloody threes on a clock. So it's 12. All right? One and two is 12. So when the fat hand and the thin hand are pointing at the one and the two, it is 12 o'clock in the daytime! <laughs> because it would be dark and you wouldn't be able to see it. <laughs> Man. How the thin hand starts to... You see how worked up he gets yeah, over the time? Yeah, like, yeah. I promise you, like... <laughs> in class and I felt like my teacher was doing the exact like same thing to you. Me. Like, I just told you what you need to know to answer this question and I would be like, so But I didn't catch it. I didn't get it. Is the big one the hour or is it the little one? The hour? Like, it was I hate, I hated it. You could not stand <laughs> telling the time. I hated it. Like, I don't know at what age I learned how to finally tell the time. I felt like I could tell the time. But like it was the adding and subtracting the time. It probably was like the first grade too, wasn't it? First grade. Uh, I feel like telling I the time is like what kindergarten, first grade, somewhere around in there, right? It was like second. Okay. Second or third grade. Okay. I know third grade we learned cursive. No, it was like second grade. And so she started raising your, raising her voice. Oh, she you. was mad. She was she was she was getting frustrated. And I was like, I don't understand. <laughs> I'll get it. Like bless your heart. But I could see like how he get worked up. I feel like I was the same way. Like she was getting worked up with me. Like I, I'm explaining this to you the best way I can. Bless your heart because if I was your teacher, <laughs> I'd have been doing the same thing. Cool. I'd have been like, we, we gotta send her. We gotta send her to the other class. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. I probably had to go in for tutoring. Transfer you to another class. Man, I quiet. can't be your teacher. Okay. Okay. <laughs> rounder. I'm just saying rounder. Now the thin hand starts to move away from the fat hand. It likes the fat hand. Yes, it likes the fat hand, but if it wants to tell the time, it has to go away from the fat hand. So it moves away from the fat hand, leaving the fat hand at the one and the two, and then it comes over to the one here by itself. You see the one to the right of the one and the two? Now, that one is five. <laughs> it is it's five two is ten three is fifteen four is twenty five is twenty five six is a half <laughs> half because twelve is the whole so six is the half <laughs> seven is twenty five two or thirty five past <laughs> So now what's actually happening is a thin hand is moving around the clock from the one to the two, which is the five and the ten. And while he's doing that, the fat hand is moving slowly away from the one and the two. Yes, because fat hands move slowly, that's right. Fat things waddle away, yes, that's it. <laughs> and now by the time the fat hand has got around to the one, which was the five, when the minute hand was pointing at it, and the one has come back right up to the one on the two. It is now what time? It is not five o'clock. <laughs> <laughs> it's one o'clock. <laughs> because when the thin hand points at it, it's minutes. The fat hand points at it, it's an hour. Now you be a good boy and learn how to read the clock. And I'll buy you a digital watch. <laughs> All of that. Okay. Okay. For him to say, I'm going to buy you a digi. Forget it. I'm just going to get you the one that says the numbers. Okay? And I, I think that's probably what it came down to. But you know what, though? What's crazy about what he's doing is, like, if you if you look like go like a lot of 
these new generation children, they don't know how to tell the time. No, not not like actually like reading like a clock. Like they, an they actual read, time. Exactly. They can read like a digital clock. Right. But they can't read like the actual time. You know, like he said, when they got the, the second hand, the hour hand, the minute hand. Some <laughs> can't really tell time based on that. That's crazy. That's crazy to think about because not only with the time, but also like cursive writing. Like I feel like cursive writing is just... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Something like of the past now. It's like it's it's like three things. I think uh learning how to tell time. Yeah. Cursive writing mm -hmm. and then just passage writing. Right. I, I think that's like those are probably like three of the main things that's like changed drastically since we were like in school. Yeah. Because I remember vividly <laughs> when we were learning how to tell time, we had so many works she's trying to teach you how yes. to tell time. And it seems like now kids, they don't even get that now. It's just all about the digital clock. Yeah. Let, I, letting the clock tell the time for you. Like really teach that? I don't even know if they teach like the actual time like that in school I don't, anymore. I'm not 100% sure. I don't think if we've they ever do, seen... they don't spend a lot of time. Yeah. Yeah, we spent a lot of time. Like that was like a whole thing. That was like a whole <laughs> week session. That was a whole of thing. Learning, yeah. uh, of learning. Learning and oh, lessons and man. things like that. I would just remember thinking, I cannot wait to be done with this. Like whatever right. this time thing is, is for the birds. <laughs> like <laughs> I do not care. It wasn't easy at first, and then and then for and then for 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 David Allen for him to be trying to explain it the way that he's trying to explain it to a child, yeah. and trying to explain it to a child for the first time. Like there's no way a child <laughs> is going to is going to understand how to tell time, and you're gonna get frustrated. He basically showed you in five <laughs> minutes. Get frustrated trying to teach the time. Trying to teach something as simple as telling the time. Yeah, but yeah, I I just remember getting yelled at the fuck the, hand. The classroom. Like I just told you what the short hand and the long hand exactly. is. Exactly. Like I, you know, I don't, all I need to know is what time I need to be here and what time we leave. I just know when it gets to the certain time at the clock. When I was in school and three fifteen came, it was time to go. No, but by the time <laughs> by the time it said three ten, be for real, you already had your books in your backpack and you was already on your way out the door. Yeah. Five minutes early. Yeah, I knew that time. Right. Okay. And and then you sit and then you sit around and you got like you got a fifty on your assignment trying to tell time. But you know what time it is when, okay. the, when the school is over with. Why are you okay. trying to call me out and, and, okay. and, and make me look bad and everything? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Talking oh, about oh I oh I don't know how to tell time but okay. but it's three ten and your books is already in your bag. Well, let's not start on the rounding session. What did you do you in rounding class? Like when you got the rounding lesson? That's true. That's true. Yeah, but it's not about me. Just though. stop right there. It's not about me. We okay. just talking about the time. No, okay, okay. Yeah, you see how y'all were trying to cut the subject off when it's time. Let's stop it? <laughs> 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 stop talking about BJ. Y'all, ask him how he did in the rounding section of the yeah. class when that lesson came around. Hey, I was immaculate. I could, <laughs> hey, I could round the hell up and I could round the hell down. I'm just saying, <laughs> okay? No, but y'all chime in. Let us know what y'all think about this in the comment Absolutely. section. If y'all enjoyed it, give us a big thumbs up. Like, comment, subscribe. Smash the notification bell so you don't miss any videos from Asian BJ. And if ain't nobody else told you, I love you. We're going to see y'all in the next video. Yeah. Your hair cute. You need to. I see you in what, my. What, what time did you get your hair done? <laughs>